Hello everyone, my name is Afshin from the Let's and Cruise Group with Keller Williams Cupertino. Thank you for allowing me to share what's happening in your local Cambrian market. You probably know just by watching your neighborhood that the last couple of years that real estate has been extremely hot and that's after 12 years of it rising steadily. We're seeing values have gone up 30 to 40 percent in some markets making them even hotter. It's important to understand that it doesn't always go up in a straight line or in one direction. There's always ups and there's always downs and if you're thinking of selling you'll need to know when is the right time for you. What we do here at the Lutz and Cruise Group is a little different. We look at a lot of detailed data, some of which I'll share with you today. For the last decade, homes have sold within 30 days on average in the Silicon Valley. A lot of the older activity to measure doesn't apply anymore. We have to measure it in months, weeks, and sometimes daily based on the specific neighborhood markets. Really excited to share that we recently helped one of your neighbors sell their home and I want to share a little bit about what we thought was going to happen and what in fact ended up happening. We sold for a really, really awesome number, one that he's really happy with, and two other neighbors sold around the same time. So here's a little bit about what we do and how we do it. What you see here is the number of listings, or rather how activity and listings are doing in the entire county compared to the same time last year. So you can see here in most neighborhoods that there's fewer listings than there were last year. Central San Jose and Willow Glen are the only ones that were higher. This has been a story of our market all year long, really record low inventory making prices higher. And even though interest rates are high and prices are high, there's sometimes negative news out there. We try to ignore this news and how people are feeling and look at how the market is reacting to help alleviate some of those fears. You can see at the bottom, Campbell and Cambrian are down almost 20% year over year. So the first half of the supply and demand story is good if you're a homeowner and you're thinking of possibly selling or are interested in the value of your home, being that there's less to choose from if you're a buyer. Part of that supply and demand equation is the demand. A good indication of supply and demand can be seen in the number of pending listings. Pendings are recordings for when a buyer and seller agree to purchase a home, but it hasn't been made official yet. And we use the number of pendings to determine the activity within a neighborhood. As you can see, some markets are down, but no market is higher than Cambrian market. It's shown 61% growth year over year. So when you look at the supply and it's down 20%, but the demand is up 61%, we then look at that delta and look at that difference. This shows that no neighborhood is hotter than yours. This is good to know because when you're ready to sell, we can assert timing and look into strategy so that you can get the highest possible dollar for your home. Here's one way we do that. We look at the absorption rate to pended sales. This measures how fast buyers in a given market are getting into contract. County numbers are 98%, which is very healthy, showing very active buyers. And then we separate more of the popular locations in Silicon Valley are doing well. Even Evergreen is at 69%, which is historically high. As you can see from the bottom, Cambrian market is up 266%, which is by far the hottest in California, if not the country. A good seller's market is anything over 33%. This is important because these homes will sell within three to four days being on the market. And because of that speed, buyers have to make quick decisions, making fast and high offers. The three properties that sold in your neighborhood will close in mid-December and, and prices will be recorded for January to show how hot the market really is. That's the kind of lead time we can provide for you as a homeowner when you're ready to sell. And if you're not ready to sell, do us a favor and tell us which of your neighbors is looking to sell so we can maximize the value of their homes, which will benefit your neighborhood and your equity. One person making a wrong decision can drop values for months. It's also important to know that the three properties that sold in your neighborhood all sold within a week and one sold for over a quarter of a million dollars more. And there's a really good reason why and we'd love to explain that to you. Thank you for listening. We'd love to make a video or meet with you in person or over Zoom and dig a little bit deeper about your neighborhood and help plan for your future move.